if somebody don't love me like this. I don't want you at all. I don't want you at all. A bitch, it's a real love right here. So before the actual video begins, I want to go ahead and actually give you guys an overview. So um, the name of the series is called From Scratch. It's a Netflix series. It's an eight-part series. Each episode is about 50 to 55 minutes long. The two main characters in the movie are Amy and Leno. From Scratch is actually based off of the real-life um, story of Timby Locke and her husband, um, Saro Gulo. I believe that's how you pronounce his name. S-A-R-O-G-U-L-L-O. So um, it, it begins in Florence, Italy, where um, Amy went to a six week art program and in the, her time being there, she met a man named Lena who was actually a chef and it is just a beautiful love story. Um, the, the destinations go from Florence, Italy to Los Angeles, California, where Amy and her family lived, where the majority of her family lived. And Sicily, where Lino was from, and his um, family live. Um, it's a lot of ups and downs, a lot of twists and turns, but it's it's wrapped in so much love um the love from the family amy has a huge family a huge huge village that they really come together for her at all times but especially when they are most needed it's a story about love and life and the the for better or worse part when things actually get worse they have um, a daughter together and it's beautiful so yeah let's get into it Hey y'all, welcome to Vlogtober Day 27. Y'all, I just got done binge watching from scratch. And when I tell y'all, I've watched a lot of shows that did not get me emotional. But when I tell you this show, it, it, it hit me. This is, this is the love that a lot of you bobblehead heifers was telling everybody that didn't exist especially on tiktok telling people that this type of love was a fairy tale type of love that people can't get nowhere under no circumstances well guess what timby lock had it she had it when i tell you this this series it's an a video series. when i tell y'all it took me it took me like 45 minutes to even pull out the camera because I had to compose myself because that's how emotional I the love that's the type of love that people oh it's doing it y'all that's the type of love that people look for that's the type of love that people pray for and that lady had it they loved each other deeply deeply and she was there for her for him when i tell y'all y'all gotta see it i know if anybody is like me i i don't get very emotional when it comes to shows but when i tell y'all this really oh this got me y'all this got me that's the, that's the type of love that people crave and a lot of people never get that Timby like had it and they loved each other so much all the way to the end and when I tell y'all the family her family the way her family welcomed him with open arms and the way her family loved him the way the way everybody pulled together when they needed to pull together it was the it was everything. It was the unity. It was the love. It was the the no boundaries. It was it was all of that. When I tell y'all, y'all gotta check this series out. This wasn't even a video I was supposed to be making today. I did not expect this. I got led to this by watching. I was on TikTok saw Ricky Thompson talking about. I said, you know, what? I'm gonna watch it today. When I tell y'all, I started watching this shit at nine o'clock this morning. I had to take breaks. I had to take breaks, y'all. This is it. This is this is the one. And when I tell y'all, the the type of love that you want from somebody that comes without struggle, that comes without strife, that comes pure and intentional. It is out there for y'all. It is real. 
it is out there for me it is out there for y'all it is out there for everybody that wants it regardless of who you are that type of love exists and i didn't even think it was a true story i had to do research on it because i couldn't believe it i said somebody actually had this somebody had that they had it you google timby lock they couldn't have picked a better cast the the way that the way that Gino's family loved her despite the the push and pull of it all it's it just if 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 the if the world had more people like the people who were portrayed in this series it would be so very different so very different a love that crossed language barriers language boundaries but you still felt it it was still understood just she had it and to Timby Lock I'm glad that Ugh. let me uh, let me light my candle we doing wild rolls of smoke y'all I'm glad that somebody who look like me who look like me experience that type of love I've, I've had love but not that not that pure not pure like that not not that intentional not not that from jump not that on purpose it didn't have to that was a that was a love at first sight and she had it I hope her daughter watches that show and really understands the type of father that she had because the man who played Gino he fantastic the whole cast was fantastic. Zoe was fantastic. When I tell y'all, did not expect it. Did not expect it. I was fine until like episode four. And then I, I, been, I was like this the rest of the episode. And I'll say it for 45 minutes. I took a pose myself. And I'm still on here. Y'all need to watch it. Go watch from scratch. And get a glimpse of love in all of its beauty and all of its ups and downs the essence of love to to be loved and to be able to love somebody like that with no boundaries through and through that man was so blindly in love with her he only he only saw her and it was very much so reciprocated i ain't i ain't got nothing else to say that's that's the vlog for today. That's the that's the that's the video for today.